turkey for me, turkey for you. I like to eat my turkey in the afternoon, cause it's turkey all day long. So some of you are wondering, man, should I cook my turkey in the oven? Or should I get experimental and fry it? Or maybe should I smoke it? I smoked this turkey, guys, and it turned out to be the most amazing turkey I've ever had in my life. The skin is crispy. The meat is juicy. I mean, it's the best tasting thing you'll ever do. You got to check this out and do this turkey right. Hey guys, my name is Hayden Young and I am the Okie Foodie King. I want to welcome you who have tuned in my channel before, but if you're new, welcome to my channel and thank you for stopping by. If you have not liked my uh, channel or if you have not subscribed, please smash that bell and please smash the thumbs up, okay? Because Facebook, when you do that, it helps get my video up to the top, all right? So what we're doing today, we are talking turkey, all right? And so uh, we're gonna smoke a turkey today and I'm just gonna go over a little bit about how this works. Um, I did a dry brine for 24 hours. I put kosher salt and pepper all over it, washed it off, let it set, let it air dry. And then I sprayed some of this Crisco butter spray right here, non-stick butter spray. It's great, okay, because it acts as a uh, binder, all right, when you put your seasonings on. And I put Head & Country, I put Montreal Steak Seasoning, and then this Killer Hogs Barbecue, all right? And so I'm gonna put it on the smoker for about 300 degrees, and then I'm gonna bump it up to 325 after that, after the hour. So uh, it should take about three and a half hours, I believe. You want the breast, all right, to read about 165, and then underneath here, the thighs, you want that to read about 175. So I'm excited, I can't wait. And man, I can't wait to see the finished product. And I know you can't either. So hang with me, let's go! All right guys, the bird is on. All right, I'm cooking it with the breast up. I'm cooking it whole. I wasn't gonna do it spatchcock, but I'm gonna go ahead and do a whole turkey. I was gonna tie these up together, but I decided, ah, I'm just gonna leave it as is, which, I was a little too rough with it this morning getting it out and I might have ripped the skin, but it's all good. So I got this pan underneath to catch all the juices and then I'm cooking it on top of these grates, all right? So that way it cooks evenly underneath and the, and the heat and the smoke will swirl underneath, making it taste mm, mm, mm. So I'm gonna let this ride for about one hour. Come back, check it out. Love to eat turkey. I love you. It's on. Stay tuned. Okay, we are at one hour. I'm just spraying this down with some butter. There we go. It's gonna help get it crispy and brown. And that's exactly what you want. I did want to tell you I bumped this turkey up to 325 but if you notice this turkey has changed I had it based in this direction and after the hour I put it to this direction all right so that way I can get it all even sprayed all sides turn around and um, spray the other side so make sure you do that every hour turn it back and forth okay guys I'm at two hours remember it's turned that way Turn it back this way now. Just let it cook evenly that way. All right. Sprayed it with butter. I've been doing it every 45 minutes. As you can see, I'm getting that golden brown color that I really, really want. So, can't wait to see what happens. Okay, guys. So, after about also an hour, 45 minutes or so, you make sure you want to get the temperature. Put in put it right into the breast. Make sure you don't hit bone. That way we make sure we hit 165. Okay guys, we are at three hours. We reach 165, 167. It's hovering in that range. Look how beautiful this bird is. Oh, 
looking beautiful. So I checked underneath the thighs too, and that's at 176. You want those about 175. So she's done. Let's take her off. Take her inside. Well, that is some bird. She is beautimous, beautiful. Look how crispy that skin is. I cannot wait to dig into that. Okie foodie king. That's how you do it right there. All right, the finished product is here. It's just staring at me. It's smiling at me. It's saying, you know, you want me, come get me, all right? This thing, guys, looks amazing. I can't wait. I'm gonna cut into this and uh, see what we got here, okay? Let me just kind of go down this breast. That's a pretty good part right there. I like that crunchy skin. I've been letting it rest for about 10 minutes, so, I mean, look at this. Oh my gosh, it's so hot. Wow, turkey for the girls, turkey for the boys. You're gonna wanna eat that turkey and take off now. That's a little uh, Adam Sandler for you, but man, guys, if you want some good advice how to cook a turkey, you've seen it, now go apply it. Your family will thank you. I mean, this is so crispy. I mean, it's so tender. I mean, it's just falling off the bone. It, wow. Woo, it looks so good, that dark meat. Hey, I'm gonna dig into this. I can't wait. So, uh, you guys have a happy Thanksgiving. Thanks for tuning in to the Oak Foodie King. Don't forget to smash the like button and smash the, I don't know, the bell. That way you get me every time. So, hey, I'm gonna enjoy this turkey. I'm gonna have the family over. We'll see you guys soon. Happy Thanksgiving.